Sergey Nazarov, co-founder of the Web3 services platform Chainlink. Sergey, thank you so much for coming back. It's great to see you again. As we think about this ruling in particular, how do you see it affecting and transforming perhaps the broader crypto industry? Because we've seen it be quite a catalyst. I just wonder if it stays that way. And the ability for banks to easily put large amounts of value into their own bank chains and then public chains into their own bank chain, into their own bank chain, to their own bank chains, into their own bank chains. Usually banks coincide their interest with whether the crypto market is up or down. Now, for the first time, I'm actually seeing banks continue to invest in large technology projects. It's like making their own bank chains. It's like making their own bank chains. It's like making their own bank chains, CIP and doing other important things like issuing real world asset tokens because the client side demand is still there. So I think what this will do is it'll make it more likely that there's more client side demand, which will have a delayed effect, but it will drive banks to invest even more in blockchains because the clients will now mm. be more comfortable with uh, getting crypto assets, which is which fundamentally has been driving the banks sure. to do. You more. basically get a huge amount of value flowing from the banks into the public blockchain world. You basically get a huge amount of value flowing from the banks into the public blockchain world. And easily go well past 10 trillion based on all the value and assets that banks are putting on chain now. and easily go well past 10 trillion based on all the value and assets that banks are putting on chain and easily go well past 10 trillion based on all the value and assets that banks are putting on chain now. I think it ends the year higher. Uh, we're consolidating, you know, between call it 28 and 32,000. I think if you, if you take out the top, we'll have a ni nice leg leg up. That might be when the Fed actually pivots and flinches. Um, you know, people have made a lot of money. And so there's some supply pressure today. BlackRock, Invesco, the, the group of ETF providers is a real signal that adoption is coming, a real signal that adoption is coming, a real signal that adoption is coming.